Hello people, my name is Rage, and welcome one and all to the patron game of the week, and as you can see, the victor in the ring of game battles. Imagine game boxes with swords and spears and shields just bloodthirstily fighting it out in an arena. I need this in my life. Was a spore. Every week, the patrons suggest any game, any game at all, and then vote on all of the many suggestions, and we have a winner. So, uh, let's get into this, because Spore is a very in-depth game. I've played it a little bit years ago. I, have, I, that's, I don't even have a memory of the game. I just know that technically I think I've played it, because it's a game that takes a while while to get into i am definitely going to do just a little bit of straight up creature creator because i kind of love it but at least to start with we'll do a little bit of your classic start from the cell and see what we do i mean let's be honest here we gonna be a meat eater let's not go crazy all up in this oh yeah while i remember the g2a link is in the description freshly with a cody thingy so our planet name Rager Kerr. Rager Kerr, that sounds like a planet, right? That makes sense. Okay. Welcome to planet Rager Kerr. It seems like a very, very hot planet. No, really, everyone on it is very sexy. Especially the Scottish Rager Kers. Ooh, we're about to land and I don't care. <laughs> the thing is with Spot, it's a really fun game. Obviously, creating everything is great but at the same time i always feel like once you get past tribal it does lose its a lot of its fun i kind of much prefer that stage i don't really like going to the civilization and then space civilization it's just never kind of gelled with me but maybe that's just me i'd love to know what you guys think of it but here we are our adorable little thing i mean to have eyes at this stage just seems very weird to me because eyes are one of the most complex evolutions that have ever happened in the history of the earth so to have them at this sort of single cell almost stage i'm not buying it game i'm not buying it spore you're just not realistic enough oh snap that one has six eyes i mean come on six of them you don't need six at this stage what are you gonna find harder the little tiny squelges of enemies because i don't I, squelges is of course an official name i don't know what your dog can do but that just seems like he's showing off it seems like he's compensating oh oh you have two eyes that's cute check out my six yeah well i bet you suck at life that's that's the best insult i i could come up with don't don't judge me <laughs> Bet you suck at life. Oh, guys, you do not want to get into a debate with me. I will mess you up. And here we see the mating dance of the Rajika species. They will spin in the water and then become a new life as they copulate by entangling their tentacle tails together and screaming like this. Ha ha! Ha ha! And then Babby is formed. <laughs> Oh, we want all of that. Oh, oh yeah. Give me, give me more of that sweet, sweet flagella. Is that it? Is that, are we done? All right. Name my species. The Ragercans, of course. The Ragercans of Ragerca. They rule yo. Of course, that is the description. Best, best audience on YouTube. See, guys, I do care. I do. Alright, that should at least enable us to power ourselves through the water a little bit better, though I'm not fully convinced. Oh, look at us go. Look at us go. We have got turning for days as we grow even larger. Isn't that just great? Though we do need to worry about other things. <laughs> yeah, I feel like even on easy, we're not even going to get to... Oh! How dare you! That is spikes! Why is it just called a spike shister? I feel like you could have been a little bit more creative. All right, it has spikes on it. What are we thinking, team? What are we... Whoa, it is. Very, I guess it heard me. It was like, you what, mate? Are you talking mad shit about my name? I will mess you up. I, I believe you. Oh, God, no, it's his friend. It's his friend. Oh, no. I mean, I'm kind of technically nearly as big as them, so surely they shouldn't be too much of a threat. Oh, I'm going to die. Guys, I suck at spawn. <laughs> Give me that. Nom, nom, nom. That one's only little, so... Can I go for it? I should be able to, right? Oh, God. They really don't like me. Like, they are not fans of... Uh, 
my poor little two-eyed creature. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Give me all that sweet, sweet meat. There it is. No, now who's the boss? Oh, God. Nearly, nearly rapidly regretted that, but that's okay. We're, we're getting there. We're growing strong. We're growing ever more powerful in the face of all of this adversary. So as long as I bite them in the ass, then I, I technically kill them, right? Come back here, Grubby! Come back here! You better run, but nothing will avail you when I'm in tow. Ha 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 ha! That was satisfying. All right, let's go eat Mr. Impressive Six-Eyed Individual. That's what you get for trying to show off, my friend. I like how our eyes bulge out our sockets when uh, we uh, get damaged. Like, we're just so shocked to even be challenged in these waters. Come on, stop being, stop being moronic. We can do this. Now, let's kill some Stabellas. Nosy's going for it. Nosy. Okay, you. You are a dead nosy. Come back here. Come back here. You can... Oh, I was about to say you can't run, but no, he very, very clearly can specifically run. That was quite brutal. Whoa, look at that size of the one underneath us. Holy hell. Oh, I, so actually, was it technically above us, maybe? Buzzy! Oh, God, you've actually got lightning. Not that it matters to me, because now you are dead. That is holy crap! It's the larval stage of Mike Wazowski from Monster, Monster, Monster! Yes, the little known alternate title to Monsters Inc. Monster, Monster, Monster! That's kind of awkward, really. It's kind of, kind of awkward. I don't know if I'm doing a bad job by not, like, evolving as much as I really should, but I guess we'll kill the other lightning. Uh, Shocker, and then run the hell away. We nearly did it, though. We're nearly at the maximum bar. We're going to crawl out of this primordial soup and claim our place among uh, the main creatures on the land. Because I hear it's happening on the land. I, I think that's what we're missing out on. Jawhead? Mother trucking Jawhead? I don't think we really need Jawhead. That is quite vicious. He, is, he has got it going on. What's up, Jawhead? What's up? We are doing well as a species. We are quite successful. Oh, man. And here we go. Cover your eyes, everybody. This is going to get 18 plus all up in here. Oh, that's spinning. That is sensual. <laughs> Ah, oh, good times, good times. All right, what are we going to make ourselves be able to do? The jet is kind of nice, and I kind of want to spit poison, become a mad rapper. Can I add more jaws? I can add more jaws. I do love the crater. It is definitely fun. Can I... Oh, we can really beef out there. Can I drag it a little bit further on? That does look a lot better. And maybe if we have tiny eyes that go... Here, that might be a little bit nicer. Can we increase our tentacles? Of course we can. That is good. And then we'll have ourselves some spike at the front. That seems pretty good. And then I think we are done. So there we are. We are now like a triple-mouthed spiky god. None shall stand in my way. <laughs> We look so stupid. Oh my god, we look so stupid. Damn you and your jets, but that's okay. We can eat all of the things now. God, we look absolutely moronic. Okay, oh, I remember when you were a problem, Squiggly. Oh god. Oh wow, that is, you've got a lot of mouths. I mean, Squiggly, I, you kind of... <gasps> oh, your head. Not today, your head. Not today. Your head. I said not to... God damn it, Jawhead! Hey, there's a Jawhead. Not today. This time, you son of a bitch, you are getting eaten. And there is nothing you can do to stop it. You can shake your booty all you want, Jawhead, but it is not going to stop you. Uh, wait, no, it, it is going to stop you. Am I being chased? J Junitor, mate. Junitor, you really want some of this? Yeah, I didn't think so. I didn't freaking think so, Junitor. I didn't think so. Look at this. Look at this. Now, that's what we call an hors d'oeuvre all up in here. Yes, we grow, we grow so strong, a mega mouth. I will help you fight. I will help. Yes. Yes. No. Kind of. Eh. Yes. 
We'll get that one, because that's right there. We're so very close, everyone. We are so very close. And we leave that one. And finally, this one. Look, we just need a few little bits more. Hello, Mega Mouth. Let's see if we can't have another little fight. Oh, you are no match for my Mega Mouth. I am the Mega of all the mouths. And there it is. Oh, no, one more. One bit of meat, and I see my target. Get out of my face, Ma. Get out of my face. Oh, you pie, you son of a bitch. Come here. Yes, there it is. Look. Here we go. We developed a brain. Yay, I'm smarter. -er. Wait. Um, not, not my fault. When it comes to swimming sludge, ah, rule. So... We don't really have much of a choice here, so let's go with Thundercalf! <laughs> We're going to be really low to the ground, definitely. And let's get that going. And then we're going <laughs> to... Oh, we're going to have tiny little eyes. Make the tail super thin, so it is actually like a moving land scorpion. <laughs> Yep, that's it. Uh, that'll do. <laughs> Alright, this game is actually, you know, it is quite fun if you like making hideous monstrosities. <laughs> wonderful. Just wonderful. A good choice once again, you uh, awesome patrons, you. Stendo, Truba, Stingto, Nergi, Fernogi, Dabit, Sogin, Kruru, Singwon, Tranakik. Okay. Look, we made it. Kind of. Um, that looks disgusting, actually, that reaching out of the sea. Oh, let's just get on land. Look at this. Now you're a creature surrounded by your next mates. Uh, oh, here we go, then. Oh, my God. Look at us. <laughs> there is so much wrong with that in such a big way. Oh, raging roar. Wow. <laughs> Let's get into combat stance here and mess his shit up. What is up? We got this. We totally got this. Come on. Fight it out. Fight it out. Come on. Kill this groupie. Kill this groupie. We can do it, I believe. Yeah, slaughter. To the victor go the spoils on our way to a bigger and smarter you. Let's nom the hell out of this. We are quite a horrific creature, actually. Like, we are really quite horrific. It's it's a little bit worrying. Look at us. Look at us go. Like, chomping that. I mean, where is our body even at? That's what I'd like to know. It's just nowhere. Oh, God. Alpha Groovy. No, we don't need to care about Alpha Groovy. Let's go get this Groovy. Yes, you better run, Groovy. You better run. Oh, that's a shame, Grooby. You are just fodder for me and my Scorpatrons. We're just done. I mean, I eventually want to get some kind of weaponry on this tail, and then we can kind of become like a scorpion-type creature. A payer. It's just a blob of meat. And, yeah, I'm going to treat it such. What is it even do? How is it biting us? It is a blob of nothing. It might as well be made out of tasty, tasty jelly. Oh, that is just terrible. Absolutely terrible. Yes, don't think I don't see you. Don't think I don't see you, because I see you. Fortunately, something shiny has caught my eye, because I'm very good at uh, getting distracted by shiny things. Oh, look, it's an, another new species. Uh, they are the chucken geese. Ah, the classic chucken geese. Uh, a very uh, simple species that I think we all know about, the... Good old classic. Oh, look! They just got taken off the island. Ali I guess aliens just abducted them. That's, that's what happens if you lose the battle. Gotta get our maiden call. Oh, yeah, it's time to wrap tails together. Isn't that just the best? <laughs> so, guys, these are the Ragicans. You, uh, you happy with your spore incarnations? I hope you are. I mean, definitely. Look at them. Look at them. They all want me. Yeah, of course they do. Let's do some sweet, sweet tentacle grabbing. Oh, what the hell happened there? Ah, oh, look at the moves! Look at the moves! <laughs> so I guess we'll just mate with everyone at once. Seems legit, honestly. Seems legit. Whoa! 
That is uh, quite excessive. There we are. That's what we need. We have suddenly got a lot more Evolvi. <laughs> In the form of weaponry. That is how we do it. That is how we do it. So, feather bluster. Let's do some feather blusters all up here. We'll get a little bit of camo going on. I think that works quite nicely. Then, we'll have... <laughs> what? Why? Why can you do this? In, in what world is this a functional animal? <laughs> What world is this a functional animal? These are fa these are mouths. Why are these mouths? I don't understand. <laughs> All right, we evolved, everybody. We did it. Welcome to the new Ragekin. <laughs> oh my God, that is. Freaking scary! Holy hell! That is terrifying! That is so, so messed up in so many ways. Oh god, we are freaky. We are freaky as hell. Oh no. Oh. At least we're being taught some new moves, but that is just, just upsetting. This is the far that, like, imagine if these existed. Oh, oh, look at this. Oh, no, this is horrific. Oh, the undulating jump. <laughs> All right, I'm going to hop into the creator. <laughs> Let's drag on this a little bit more sensibly then. Okay, so I guess potentially we'll have that coming out there. That makes sense. Can we extend this a little bit? This seems like a good enough body to start with. So let's actually have a look through everything then. Snagly, so we got all these uh, parts to use. Ooh, I kind of like this as a mouth. That's, that's quite a nice little... Uh, look he's got going on there. I want to have a fairly sizable chomp on that. I think that makes sense. And then if we blow up the head to be proportionate, that would make sense. Get a little bit of the body going. Okay, I kind of want to actually end up with maybe something that you could see as a creature, you know? Maybe something along those lines. They actually kind of work with that jaw. They do. Some feet. What have we got to work here? We do have uh, insectoid uh, feet. Like, they look quite cool. It's definitely very freaky, but that's, that's an interesting style. I do like that. Let's have uh, two pairs of those on the top. I think we can deal with that and then maybe have more of a focused uh, approach here and then have this come a little bit further forward like so that kind of works and then we've got these two work with like that they can just stay there get a little bit beefier because it's got to support this animal's weight which is uh, Obviously, and the actually no, that one doesn't look that good. In fact, all right, we'll we'll abandon we'll abandon the high stock legs. That that wasn't as good as it could have been. So we'll get back down to here. We could have a very ground-based creature, couldn't we? Like much more crawly along the ground. I mean, this is great fun. Like there is a lot I can apparently do with this. Let's get some legs then. That one I do kind of like, and then. We'll go with, actually, maybe we could go, I mean, that's kind of cool, isn't it? That's not bad. And then we've got, like, a kind of dinosaur level, though. I feel like that's not the most terribly original, original creation. That kind of works out. I'm, I'm a fan of that. And then I want to... <laughs> what the fuck? What the hell have I 
just done? Oh man, oh man, that is that is something. All right, I think maybe I've got a little bit too overboard here. That is for sure. But at the same time, I can work with this. I definitely can work with this. We'll have that come forward like this. <laughs> I'm sorry, but this entire thing is just, I'm in love. I think I'm in love, guys. I really think I am. So what happens if we massively fully inflate all of this? So we just become basically a balloon thing. That's kind of nice. So I guess we want to deflate a little bit just so we have our head at least visible. There we go. And then we'll deflate a little bit in the middle. All right, so in terms of actual feet, then let's go for uh, let's go for the raptor claws. Yeah, go on, look at us go. Look at us. Does one of our hands not actually have hands on? Because I feel like that's an issue. If that's true, there we have it. Okay, can I have a hand there? Oh, I wanted to put a hand on its tail. That would have been brilliant. Oh, we can have horns. I do like horns. Can. Have them going round there. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> there is so much wrong with this in so many ways. And I, I don't even know how to say it. I really, really don't. There's just... Too expensive? Oh, I'm actually low on the on uh, whatever it is that creates all of this horrific. <laughs> no, that's, just look at this. Holy hell, okay. Holy hell. I want him to be a little bit forward, but then I do want us to go as high up as possible. And then we'll shake that out there so we can be like, ha, 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 ha. Welcome to our stomping individual hippity hop. Ah, yeah. Ah, yeah. All right. Here we go. He's angry at that. <laughs> I mean, it's not horrible, I don't think. I don't really think there's, there's been worse creatures made in Spa. <laughs> okay, let's, um... Let's, uh... Let's, let's do, we'll do, uh, we'll do one more. <laughs> okay, so if we get ourselves some horrific looking arms and then put them up here like this. And then some more there. Just keep this going basically. And then get them up on there. So we've got like four sets of arms. That kind of works out for us. And then we want a load of legs, I would say. Kind of uh, just going across the bottom of our body. So I want you guys to name these creatures that I'm coming up with. Name the previous Stupidosaurus. Though, don't actually call it that, I guess. That might be a mistake if I bring this one up like this. So we've got a fair amount of pairs of legs. And then for sight, we can go for... A antenna, which can go down our body. There it is. Oh, I'm kind of low on DNA. Why can't I just have infinite DNA? That's so sad. That is so, so sad. And then I guess we'll have a flower for a mouth. That kind of makes sense. Right? <laughs> this thing is horrific. <laughs> this thing is absolutely horrific. And then we'll have a springle tail. That's going to just keep coming down for as long as it's going to let us, basically. And then a little bit of uh, watery balls. They seem like they might be fun. Just, just give it some texture, you know. Give it a little bit more, more oomph to it. This, this mangle sort of uh, mutated uh, insect thing 
Let's have a derma blank up all up in here. There we go. We'll put a haycorn on. Everybody likes a bit of haycorn. And then we'll have a feather buster just chilling. More of these guys towards the back. And uh, yeah, I think it's looking pretty good. We'll give it a more scaly look. Like so. And then we'll take it for a test drive, everyone. Oh. Oh, God. It's horrific. It is horrific. Look at this. What is it even doing? Oh, my God. Let's see what it looks like when it's sad. I don't think that is sad in any way, but we'll make it hippity hop. <laughs> hey, baby. How do you think about this? I think it's pretty cute. Ah, yeah. Oh, this is just not good. Scared. <laughs> Oh, what does it look like when it tries to grab something? Sit. All right, then. Punch. Oh, look at it go. It's four arm punch. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at this thing. You would be scared out your mind if this thing walked up to you. <laughs> okay, guys. I think I've had my fun. Let me know what you thought of a little bit of Spa Patron Game of the Week. I had fun, definitely. Oh, if you want to support me on Patreon and the future of my channel in general, obviously it's not required, but it is in the description. Like if you enjoyed this, subscribe for more, and I will see you next time. Oh, God. <laughs> a good boy.